A lot of people watching updates for the second defamation trial of Donald Trump are questioning why there are so many repeated times that the judge has to stop Donald Trump's lawyer and tell them they can't bring that up or they can't talk about that. Well, in my opinion, that was always the plan. This entire trial, they've decided to go try to make it more of a publicity stunt than an actual trial because he is guilty as sin. It is hard to argue that he is innocent when he has previously been found guilty of defamation and then is defaming the woman as he enters court using his own social media platform. But some more evidence that, you know, just throwing everything out there and making a spectacle of it was always the plan is right here. This is a document from E. Jean Carroll's lawyer warning about the plan coming from Trump's team. First, as your honor is aware, after defendant included Miss Martin on his witness list in this action, plaintiff moved to exclude her on the ground she had no relevant testimony to offer on the narrow damages issued that remained in this action. So here we have beginning here, he's already doing things that don't make sense. And as we continue down here, we get down to second. After your honor, January 9th ruling on plaintiff's motion in Lime, a uh, plaintiff identified several defendant's exhibits that were clearly inadmissible in the light of the court's decision. So they had a court decision they couldn't use this and still tried to use it. And then if we keep going, further defendant's position on the scene and interview and his other exhibits suggest that he plans to impermissibly repackage an off-limits motive and fabrication argument as an argument concerning mitigation of rebutable harm so basically they're calling it out here that he is just trying to go against court orders to make a spectacle of it which he is if you go and look up on twitter it's a spectacle they're going up and saying things and constantly being stopped by the judge finally our concern is further compounded by the fact that we have not yet seen most of the exhibits that the defendant will likely seek to introduce during cross-examination there's also been problems where they weren't introducing evidence correctly Given defendant's unwillingness to meaningfully meet and confer on evidentiary issues and his repeated disregard of the court's evidentiary orders in this litigation position in public statements, including as recently as today, we are justifiably worried the trial will turn into an endless series of sidebars at which the court will need to review defense exhibits, which it basically has. That basically has happened. Their, their worry happened. Now, this is a official document. As you can see, it's filed uh, January 11th, 2024 for the court. I'll have a link to this in the pinned comment if you would like to see it yourself. But yeah, so your people are seeing this and going, wow, how did this not get stopped? Why didn't they have like more orders in place to prevent all these sidebars and all these problems? They did. Trump's people just ignore the rule of law.